Yo, 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 how's it going? This is Mo Verne on the move. Happy home day. Welcome here, you know, to Toronto Path. Special shout out to my director, Joseph Morris. You know, this few days, the weather is just very fluctuating. Yesterday was a beautiful warm day, and today it's like winter jacket everywhere, kind of goose. But don't worry, this studio is getting hotter and more steamier because, as you see the intro of the video that I just showed you, a group of handsome men, which they call themselves HIM or HIM, uh, promotions. They're actually doing a show right tonight in Toronto, uh, the Great Hall, located at 1087 uh, Queen Street West. They're going to perform a show. It's very sensual. It's very uh, acrobatic and very energetic. And they're going to be in my studio. However, I was just giving a heads up that they're stuck in traffic. So they will be coming soon. But you know what? There's always what's hot around Toronto. And most importantly, the reason why I'm here in the universe is because today's one of the biggest news is that you know one of the aircraft that were that were in universe that one of uh, European aircraft was put in space for 10 years circling in the universe and finally today it has successfully landed on one of the comet and I think this is the first time that an aircraft has landed on comet a major human breakthrough I never seen the astronaut land on the moon because I wasn't born yet, but to actually see this aircraft on the comet is amazing. Check out the celebration at the space station on this special moment. Bit muted. Oh, hang on. So we've got some cheers going on behind us. Do we know what's going on? They don't yeah. look so excited in the well, these, these guys here, yes, we're down on the surface. That oh. is, that's <laughs> absolutely wonderful. The guys here cheered first and then down on the screen, so the messages came through. What a moment, really. I mean, this is where I get emotional, I'm afraid. <laughs> we can see the guys here throughout Europe. Uh, the people have been working on this for years. We're on the surface. Now, again, we have to wait. The next Beautiful celebration. You know what? At first, I really thought the station only had five or six people, and I think it is. And then suddenly it shows the whole group of people hugging. If it is my style of celebration, I'll probably, probably you know, throw a few golden champagne, golden shower, and then just have a champagne shower, all celebration. But this is a beautiful day, beautiful announcement there. And you know what? The second thing that, oh, by the way, and I know a lot of you guys have been responding on my Twitter, retweeting, and, you know, I'm giving away two contest prizes. The first one, as everybody knows, the Gentleman Expo is going to be held this weekend. Whoever like USC champion GSP Jordan Pair is going to be there. Leafs player, former Leafs Gary Roberts is going to talk about his fitness, his physical fitness. There are a lot of things going to be happening there. The beer, craft beer, gentlemen, suits, ties, how to dress nice, how to enjoy life. That's what Germans Expose is all about. So it, it, it's also for ladies too if you want. And it's basically it's amazing gentleman Expo. I was there last year and this is the second year now. Going strong. And if you're a UFC fan, you better go there. After the show, I'm going to announce a winner who's going to win a pair of tickets to go to Gemini Expo that is good for the weekend. Now, the second contest that I also throw is that the HIM promotions are going to have the shows tonight. And two lucky winners will win a pair of tickets to watch the show tonight. So we'll find out who is going to be there. So the second thing I'm going to do, you know the Raptors? 7-1, baby. They're amazing. They're winning. They're the, on top of the world. They're best in the Yeast Conference. As a Raptor fan, it's great, great news, you know. Now, five years ago, me and Sammy T, one of my favorite buddy now, we did a video about Raptors fan, and it was where Mulverney all started the journey. Uh, like, the reason why I'm here today was because of that video. It was a throwback, it's still a classic, and check out some of the throwback classic video footage right there. And we were watching this video. Yo, guy, Raptors fan. On the internet. How's it going? Uh, it's a classic. This is Mulverney. Welcome to my first Mulverney videos for this season. Stop Sixers, you know, you know, rappers celebrating 20th anniversary. So decide, Miss Amity and I decided to celebrate and check out our first ever video together. Woo, number one! Yeah, I got it. <laughs> and it was a classic, man. It's still relevant. Talking about Purple Jersey, Dana Stoudemire, DeMar DeRozan, Amir Johnson. And you know, Sammy T first yeah. ever rap on Raptor Space. Yo guy, Raptor fans, how's it going? This is Mo Verney. Welcome to my first Mo Verney videos for this season. I'm very excited for the upcoming Toronto season, Raptor season. Are you ready? I'm ready and I'm very excited. Right now I'm live at Union Film Main Street and I want to see if I can interview any Raptors play uh, Raptors fans here. Let me see if I can get any Raptors. Yo guy! Yo, what's up? Look like you're a Raptor fan. I am Mo P. Wanna be interviewed by Mo Verney? You're Mo Verney? Yeah, this is Mo Verney. Yeah, let's do it. Alright. Who's your favorite Raptor of all time? 
Damon Sodomire, Mighty Mouse, little guy doing big things, inaugural season, rookie of the year. Ah, oh, it's just so exciting to watch. Yeah, I agree. It, uh, it actually got me excited to uh, follow the Raptors ever since. Yeah, man. Always nice to see my buddy Sammy T. Always nice to see the Raptors fans. Tomorrow, Chicago Bulls is in town. Hopefully, Derrick Rose is going to play. And most importantly, I'm going to be covering the Raptors social, which is a charity event on Monday, November 17th at The Music. So there will be all the current Raptors players as well as alumni such as Mopi is going to be there. So if you have any questions that you want me to ask the players, make sure you tweet to me at Mo Verney and check it out, you know. Hey, and um, most importantly, yesterday, November 11th, is Remembrance Day, which uh, I'm very proud to be a Canadian and very proud to be in this country. We got to thank every, uh, those people, the war veterans who fought for us and protect and give us this freedom. And yesterday I decided to walk to Old City Hall to actually see the whole ceremony. Um, the greatest moment for me to, to soak it all in yesterday was there, the, 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 the intersection at Old City Hall around it was blocked, but everybody was standing there for the silent moment of silence. And most importantly, there were hundreds and thousands of people there paying the tribute to the people, but yet it was so silent. And that, that is a moment that I'll, I will definitely want to do it again uh, year after year. And I, I hope one day that Ontario, you know, our province, will actually give it a holiday so that we can spend more time to pay a tribute to, to allow the people to get off work, to, to actually use the day to actually participate in a lot of these uh, Remembrance Day to actually give back and think about all the people that fight for us. And hopefully this is, if you're watching this show, I really hope that politicians can really consider about giving this a holiday so that the whole country united, the whole country can actually remember this special day. We're going to show some of the video that I took yesterday. You know, I, I still remember the Flanders field, the poppies. And um, you know what? Another thing that I want to show you, a few weeks ago, Kenna's Walk of Fame, uh, I was able to sit very close to the VIP section, and in front of me were sitting the celebrities. And Ryan Reynolds, Ra Rachel Van Adams were the inductee for this year, Kenna's Walk of Fame. Right after the show, the production was over, I was able to walk close to them, ch chat with them a little bit. Here's some video footage of Rachel Van Adams up close and Ryan Reynolds talking to the children um, at the show. <laughs> Both are very nice people. Now, you know what? I was told, I got, I just got a tweet. They said that the show is going to start at 9 o'clock tonight. So I better announce the first winner for the hymn production, the promotion, the Coliseum show tonight. is going to be very exotic, very sensual. Uh, I'm sure the ladies will love it. So the winner is going to be Marta Shakoka. You are the winner for winning to see the show. So you can, you can get the tickets right at the booth service and you just go there and uh, enjoy the show and uh, bring your guests. I'm sure there'll be a lot of screaming girls, a, a lot of ladies screaming around with all these handsome men. So stay tuned, keep a log and check out the commercials. Move friends out here.